Hello everybody. If you managed to create your own owner APIs, congratulations, you are one step closer to becoming an API engineer. I'm going to do it to show you guys what is the solution. Create a new file and name it owner.js. I'm going to type it again step by step so that the concept will stick with you guys. But I'm just going to copy this owner, change this to owner. By now, you already know what to do. Post API and router dot post owners sing request response try and catch So it is pretty similar like the previous one. So we're just gonna create the get API. copy this and put it in catch save this and let's export this and go to server copy this route and then copy this route this change this save it and go back to owner and as you can see that we posting as you can see we are using a post method the name is owners and we pass in a sync because we want to avoid callback hell request and response and then we create a new owner object save it to the body of the name and about and then we save it and we pass in a wait so that Again, we want to avoid callback hell. And then we want to respond with a success true and then the message. And then we want to catch if there's any error. And as for get, same thing, a sing, and then try catch. Find the owner, all of the owner, and then responds back with all of the owners. So that's it. Let's go to Postman and test it out. Copy this it here change the post change the owners name about brad stone my name is brad stone post successfully create a new owner and let's copy this And let's get there's nothing here let's go back to our owners let's go back most likely we made a mistake here all right we send a param so let's go to body and let's go to name brad stone about my name is 
is Brad Stone. Sen successfully created a new owner and let's get it and there you have it. Let's create another owner. Which Walter Isaacson copy his name and change it to here. And then let's get again. Now we have three owners. I'm gonna delete this. Let's go to our database, refresh. And now we have owners. And let's delete this. Delete it. And we have deleted. And now we have these two official owners. So there we have it. We have successfully created an owner APIs. So I'll see you guys in the next video where we are going to complete our product APIs. It will be pretty much the same. There will be get all products and it will be get a single product. And then we have to update our product and delete our product. If you can figure it out by yourself, give it a shot. If you can't, you can see the solution. I'll see you guys in the next video.